Glennon from the Earth Medicine Institute here in downtown Hanoi. And I am here with my friend Han Nguyen, who has a, a really great restaurant here in Old Town Hanoi called Farms Food. And um, Ha was kind enough to introduce me to a great mixture of Vietnamese and Western cooking. She is an expert in, um, in French cooking also? Yeah. Yes. Vietnamese and French cooking. Vietnamese and French cooking. So today we are going to put a recipe together with um, foods that are good for inflammation. There are two biochemical pathways in the body that strongly influence chronic inflammation. One is NRF2 and the other is NFKB. NRF2 will decrease inflammation in the body. NFKB will increase inflammation in the body. So what we want to do is increase NRF2 and decrease NFKB. Now there are some foods that increase NRF2 and other foods that decrease NFKB and some foods do both. So we've especially selected uh, foods for this recipe, for this meal, that will, that will do one or the other or both. And I'm really excited to see what um, Ha comes up here upstairs in, uh, on a busy Hanoi morning. And Ha has selected some vegetables. We talked about different possibilities for um, making a recipe and, and Ha decided that the best thing to do would be to just make a simple stir fry. Now again, we've chosen foods that increase NRF2 and decrease NFKB. So this is a special anti-inflammatory meal. Now, most people choose with the vegetarian food and uh, all the people know it's very good for health. Yeah, yeah, yeah. vegetables are very good yeah, for health. Yeah, very good for health. Yeah. Same here, we take it about the, it's the green bean, bell, honey, and cauliflower, carrot, daikon. So all of them are really good vitamin too. So I chose today, we will cook that with the, the garlic, give more flavor and also them, it's really good for health. Okay. Yeah. So we have, um, yeah, we have the, the vegetables. Now, the broccoli is especially anti-inflammatory. Um, broccoli sprouts, which have sulforaphane in them, are incredibly anti-inflammatory agents. But we didn't, we didn't have any sprouts, so we're going to use regular broccoli. Um, broccoli, the, the cauliflower, the onions, and we have um, chayote here. Mm -hmm. Ginger, ginger, we have some special turmeric. Turmeric. And the yes. turmeric and the black pepper go very well together to decrease inflammation. And garlic and um, beans. Yes. 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 Customers, but this is really good. The chayote is awesome. 